Hey everybody. Buzz uh, Gaming here. <laughs> Hanging out with a running Mr. Buzzsaw right there on the TurboGrafx 16. <laughs> In the background. Super Metroid on the CRT. Anyways, <laughs> look at the Jaguar right there. Right into Super Nintendo. All over the place today. Anyways, we're here to bring you our top 10 gaming consoles of all time. Now, keep in mind, this is uh, my opinion. Dude with a pet lizard on the internet. And also, keep in mind that this primarily covers generation 3 through 6, uh, which are the core of gaming in my opinion. So it won't cover the more modern consoles, uh, except for one. And uh, also it won't cover the early first and second generation consoles as well. Uh, so this is a top 10. And basically, I do have some honorable mentions as well. <laughs> Those are buses all over the place today. <laughs> My first honorable mention is the Atari Jaguar. Oh, <laughs> Mr. Bussa is out. He's all over the place and he's gone. <laughs> Anyways, honorable mention number one, Atari Jaguar. Absolutely love it. Love the uh, the quality first person uh, shooters on there. Uh, absolutely awesome. I like this uh, early era, fifth generation, so much fun. Other honorable mentions would be also Sega Saturn, which I don't have a ton of experience with, and Sega Master System as well, uh, which I also don't have a ton of experience with. But uh, anyways, yeah, those are my uh, honorable mentions. And into the top 10. Number 10, right there. Sega Dreamcast. I love this console. I mean, this is an awesome console. It's so cool. I love the graphics, the arcadey style of it, the unique games. I mean, the Dreamcast is absolutely amazing. Absolutely love it. So cool. I mean, Sega Dreamcast is just, uh, you know, it was the end of Sega and it was just such a cool console. I have the black one there, right? Uh, the sports edition. I think it looks so sleek and so nice. And that's my number 10 entry. It's got just awesome, awesome games. I really love it. Really the end of an era. Absolutely awesome. A perfect number 10 on my list here. And number nine. The original Sega Genesis right there. The original Model 1. Absolutely love the Genesis. Love that style. Like that 16-bit goodness of the Genesis. Absolutely love it. I mean, it's got a great library. I mean, I didn't grow up with the Genesis, so I'm just getting in more into the library. So I absolutely love it. Absolutely, uh, you know, just so beautiful. Uh, really cool spin. You know, it was nice to see something that wasn't Nintendo. So really awesome. My number nine pick right there is the Sega Genesis. Number eight. GameCube. <laughs> this is relatively new for me. Uh, I didn't have the GameCube uh, in the sixth generation. I just wasn't into the style at the time, but now it's just absolutely awesome. I really love the art take on it, the styling of it. Uh, it's just so cool. I mean, the first party Nintendo games, the first party Nintendo sports games, absolutely awesome. Really love it. It's just such a great system. You know, my number eight pick for the, the best uh, console of all time. Nintendo GameCube. Number seven, PlayStation 2. Now you can also do PlayStation 1 as well. I combine them. PlayStation 2, PlayStation 1 right there is my uh, number seven pick. Absolutely love it. Quality game, so much fun. Such a great system, revolutionary. Love the DVD player in there. I mean, PS1, PS2 games, I mean, who doesn't love that era of gaming? It's absolutely awesome. I mean, PS1, absolutely revolutionary, and PS2 took it to the next level. So absolutely love it. So many awesome games on it. I mean, just such a gigantic library. I mean, it's it's almost inexhaustible. There's so many games. Just an absolute awesome time. Love the PS2 and the PS1 right there, number seven. 
Number six, this chunky beast right here. The Xbox, the original. Now this was my main console in the sixth generation. Love the games for it. It's still cheap to this day. You know, arguably the third party games play the best on the Xbox in the sixth generation. They've got great exclusive games. Also a lot of Sega games that led it to be called Dreamcast 2. So absolutely love the original Xbox. So much fun. Oh, <laughs> Mr. Buzzsaw charging around right there. Looking for trouble. Anyways, number six entry is the original Xbox. Also has DVD playback capability as well, which uh, unfortunately you need a dongle and a control, but still absolutely awesome. And it's got a hard drive which was uh, new to the gaming world at that time. So absolutely love it. So cool. Number six, the original Xbox. Number five, PS4, my only semi-modern system, PlayStation 4. I captured a lot of PS3, PS4 games here. Absolutely love it. I mean, Red Dead Redemption, Ratchet and Clank. I mean, there's so many great games, the Uncharted games. I mean, absolutely beautiful. It's an awesome system. You know, the only drawback is the, the, the one terabyte hard drive is not enough. It fills up, so you need an external hard drive as well. But just beautiful, absolutely love it. I spend so much time on the PS4. I think it's an awesome system. Also, caveat too, this is my only system that's uh, not uh, you know between third and sixth generation. Uh, also, I don't have a Switch, so I don't have experience with the Switch, but from what I can tell, it probably would be a top 10 as well. But uh, not on this list, as I, I don't have experience with the Switch yet. Anyways, let's see. That's my PS4 right there. Absolutely wonderful. Yeah, I had a, such a great time with it. I mean, I like the styling of it too. And number five, PS4. Number four of my favorite consoles of all time is this one right here, the TurboGrafx-16. I mean, growing up, I was a big supporter of TurboGrafx-16. I like the art style. I like the colors. I like the games. I like the soundtrack. I mean, there's just so much to offer, even the Hue cars, and you can hook it up to your TurboGrafx Express. I mean... It was a dream system for me. Absolutely love it. Unfortunately, I don't have the CD attachment. I would like to do that to get some of the CD games uh, as well. But, uh, you know, everything is extremely expensive, unfortunately, for Toy Rapid 16. So I should have jumped on that earlier. But unfortunately, I did. And I just had the the uh, the old Hue cards. This is what I uh, I remember as a kid uh, was the Hue cards. So anyways, TurboGrafx 16 right there. My number four pick of uh, the top 10 greatest consoles of all time. Number three, Nintendo 64. Absolutely love the Nintendo 64. I mean, Ocarina of Time, Mario 64. I mean, Conqueror's Bad Fur Day. There's just so many great games. It's got a unique style. I mean, you can tell a Nintendo 64 game from anything else. I mean, you just know what it is. It's got that look to it. Even I like the controller. I like the whole thing. I like the whole package. I've always been a fan of Nintendo 64. I like it that they stuck with the carts, even though people don't like that. I like the carts. I like the old-fashioned way, even though it limited it a bit as far as the amount of um, you know storage capacity on each cart. But absolutely love Nintendo 64. So awesome. Such an awesome console to this day. My number three favorite console of all time. Number two, the original NES, Nintendo Entertainment System. Now, I grew up with this system. It was my first real, real gaming console, I would say, before I had the Color Computer 2, which was really good, but very primitive compared to NES. And this thing, just so many franchises started there. It just blew the world away. I mean, the original Nintendo... Oh! <laughs> Mr. Buzzsaw is darting around like a... I don't know, like an alien or something, just running around. Anyways, um, yeah, I mean, Mario started out, Zelda started out, Metroid started out. I mean, the list goes on and on of the great games of the original Nintendo. Such a great library. I mean, how can you go wrong with the original Nintendo? Absolutely awesome. Love it so much. My number two pick, greatest system of all time. And number one, 
The original, right there. Super Nintendo, my pick for the number one best console of all time. So awesome. I mean, look at those beautiful games. I mean, Super Metroid right there. I mean, one of the best of all time. Uh, you know, Zelda, Link to the Past. I mean, it took those great games from the original Nintendo and beefed them up to 16 bits. You know, made the bosses bigger, made the characters bigger. Just absolutely awesome, the original Super Nintendo. I mean, unfortunately, it is pricey nowadays, but it's just such a great system. I mean, I think if I were to have just one, I mean, this would be the one I would hang on to. Absolutely love it. The original Super Nintendo, my number one pick for the greatest uh, system of all time. <laughs> Anyways, I'll pan out to all the systems right there so you can check them out. There's number 10, the Dreamcast. Number nine, Genesis. Number eight, GameCube. Number seven, PS2 and PS1. Number six, the original Xbox. Number five, PS4. Number four, TurboGrafx-16. Number three, N64. Number two, the original NES. And back to number one, Super Nintendo. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the list. Uh, maybe put below, so what are your top 10 or top five consoles of all time? I'm always curious to hear uh, what you guys like. You know, this is my experience in the, the consoles I've played that I own. So there are a couple out there, like I mentioned before, in the honorable mentions I don't have experience with, but I'm sure are awesome as well. So anyways, have a wonderful day.